Welcome to the Eye on the Reef training program. This module covers the Eye on the Reef integrated monitoring system. Welcome to the Eye on the Reef training program. In this module, we explain the scope of the Eye on the Reef program and our overall strategy to monitor the health and well-being of the Great Barrier Reef. The Great Barrier Reef is an amazing place. Part of what makes it so special is its sheer size. With over 2,900 reefs, islands and caves, it's bigger, more diverse and more isolated than most of us can imagine. And that's why we need your help. The Great Barrier Reef Marine Park Authority and its partner organisations in management and research have developed a way you can help us keep an eye on what's happening out on the reef. The Eye on the Reef Integrated Monitoring System combines observations gathered by marine park users with information from dedicated research and monitoring programs run by the Great Barrier Reef Marine Park Authority, the Queensland Government and the Australian Institute of Marine Science. Using a team of divers trained to conduct visual census surveys, the AIMS Long-Term Monitoring Program has been surveying the health of 47 reefs throughout the Great Barrier Reef since 1993. The long-term monitoring program surveys represent the longest continuous record of ecological change in Great Barrier Reef communities over such a large scale. While valuable about what it can tell us about the long-term trends in coral and fish communities, this work is expensive and is only conducted every one to two years. To keep our fingers on the pulse of the Great Barrier Reef, the Eye on the Reef Integrated Monitoring System includes several other sources of information. It starts with our Early Warning System, which has been designed to harness the eyes, ears and goodwill of marine park users everywhere to provide near real-time snapshots of wildlife happenings or reef health events across the geographic scope of the Great Barrier Reef. Anyone can provide information to the early warning system, either through the sightings network or by completing the training for the Eye on the Reef Rapid Monitoring Survey. The Rapid Monitoring Survey collects opportunistic information about reef health indicators, protected and iconic species and emerging issues. The next tier in the Eye on the Reef Integrated Monitoring System involves the Tourism Weekly Monitoring and Reef Health Impact Survey programs. These programs collect more formal, standardised biological information at a large number of sites spread across a wide geographic area. This ongoing data collection provides meaningful information about the health status of the reef. The Tourism Weekly Monitoring Program collects reef health information at frequently visited sites. This is used, along with data from the Reef Health Impact Survey Program, or RIS for short, to evaluate reef health and the severity and extent of major impacts. The Tourism Weekly Monitoring and RIS programs require more training and rigour than the other reporting methods. This training package focuses on developing the skills required for RIS. Good data is valuable in both the short and long term and the results of RIS reports can be immediately communicated to reef managers. The data that you collect under the Eye on the Reef program goes into the Eye on the Reef database. The Great Barrier Reef Marine Park Authority and Queensland Parks and Wildlife Service use this database to collect and collate data from across all Eye on the Reef programs. The data is then used to create reports and maps, target research, fill knowledge gaps, and better manage the marine park. In combination with long-term trend information from the AIMS Long-Term Monitoring Program, 
the Eye on the Reef system provides summaries of the severity and extent of impacts. This enables management actions to be more effectively targeted to support the amazing diversity of the Great Barrier Reef. So in summary, the early warning system provides near real-time observations at a whole of Great Barrier Reef scale. While the Tourism Weekly Monitoring Program keeps a regular eye on the reef health status of dozens of frequently visited tourism sites. And RIS provides snapshots of reef health anytime, anywhere, in a standardised, quantifiable way. It also provides a fast, effective and reliable way of assessing the extent and severity of impacts on the reef. Finally, the AIMS Long-Term Monitoring Program provides scientifically rigorous information about the trends in the long-term health of fish and coral communities along the length of the Great Barrier Reef. Altogether, these programs form a cost-effective solution to the challenge of monitoring one of the world's largest and most important marine parks.